Hey y'all, welcome to a new video. Today I have some things that I want to share with y'all. I have been picking up some things or I picked up some things in um, March. I think most of all of this I bought in March. And then um, I do have some things that are still coming that I picked up in February that was supposed to be here, but they're not here yet. And yeah, so <laughs> let's just go ahead and jump into this right here. Okay. First up, we have a small purchase from uh, Sticker Guru. Now y'all, this is a very tiny purchase, but um, <laughs> I'll explain it to you guys in a minute. But here is the thank you card. Oh my gosh, I love the hand lettering, y'all. I wish I could do that, but I can't. <laughs> Anywho, there's that. And then there's another little card in here. It says, join the club. I guess they have a monthly subscription box. And then there's a code for the monthly box. Uh, if I want to use that and then on the back of this card there is a shopping list let's see it says we're in the PBC sale April 16th 9 a.m. Eastern time through April 18th get ready by making your shopping list and checking it twice and then they are offering 25% off I guess for the PBC sale Oh, that's nice and that's neat. Uh, I have kind of put myself on a no spin for April, but I might have to break that no spin for the PBC sale. Anywho, uh, this is what I picked up from Sticker Guru, y'all. I purchased a kit from Vanilla Paper and Co. that has not made it here yet, but I did pick it in halo foil and it does have butterflies in it so i had missed out on picking the halo items on um sadie stickers uh butterfly release so when i saw that she had released these items or a sticker guru because i think that's a sister team i was like let me get some of these um uh, items now the only thing I picked up y'all were these date covers as you can see and then I picked up these butterfly deco because in her release that was you know that was really all that I saw I had wanted but y'all guess what happened on the same day that they released this butterfly collection Sadie stickers brought back some of her $2 Tuesday favorites and guess what was in that favorites her butterfly collection <laughs> so I ended up getting some more things from that collection as well and I think I actually got this same sheet right here y'all which I'm not mad at it because I can put these butterflies in monthlies or just in other um, spreads in general but yeah I wish I had known that she was gonna bring back her butterfly collection because I could have saved some shipping on this right here but nevertheless I have them they are gorgeous as you guys can see the halo uh, in the camera but yeah that's why this is such a small purchase but that's everything I picked up from Sticker Guru. Next, I have a purchase from Oso oh Paper. This is my first time purchasing stickers from her. And what I picked up, y'all. Oh, look how cute that is. So, so cute. So, this is a freebie. And it's a sticker. And it looked like it's mom combing daughter's hair and daughter is combing her daughter's hair right is that not what that's supposed to be y'all I think so anyhow there's the freebie and I love it so much but I picked up some of her character girls I love these when I saw them I don't know how I got onto this uh, company 
Do I follow her? Maybe I follow her now, but anyhow, y'all. <laughs> I picked up the laundry, Courtney, that's her name. And she has uh, natural hair, which I am not natural, y'all, but I picked these up. Can you guys see her? She's so cute holding all of the different color um, laundry baskets there. And then I picked up the Desiree in her uniform. I can use these to mark work. So I thought these were really cute. And I'm assuming that she has just relaxed hair or pressed hair. So there she is, y'all. And then I picked up Courtney in Let's Plan. And I don't know if you guys can see all of the little planners or in different colors there. She has the same shirt on, but all of the planners are in different colors. And then I picked up Bianca in the computer where it says at work, but I'm gonna be using it for, for um, things that I do when I do something on the computer like uh, commenting and you know editing and all of that good stuff is what I'll be using these for. And then I picked up Bianca buying the groceries, y'all. She's grocery shopping. But yeah, guys, I love these. And I'm, I'm wanting to kind of, um, when I do my plan with me's, I'm wanting to use all of the same girls in in a spread, if that makes any sense, y'all. Instead of me using, you know, four or five different uh, girls from different uh, shops, I want to use the same girls and then, you know, mix it up with some icons and things like that. So uh, that is why I picked up these girls and I liked them. I thought they were really cute. <laughs> But that's everything that I picked up from Oh So Paper. Next, I have a purchase from a Birch and Birdie. And y'all, look at this cute packaging. And look at that washi tape, y'all. I was like, OMG, that washi tape is so cute. I wanted to mail her and ask her where she got this washi tape from. Because I was like, I need some washi tape like that, y'all. And it matches the little envelope that the... Uh, stickers came in i was like that is so so cute i love this washi tape y'all but anywho let's get into these stickers i don't even want to tear it up because it's so cute let me see if i can not rip it oh well there we go <laughs> I don't know if I said, but this is my first time purchasing something from Birch and Birdie, y'all. And make sure I get all of that out without tearing all that up. But here we go. I have, let's see. I love coffee. I love tea. I love you. And I love me. <laughs> How cute is that? And then there is a um, coupon code on the back of there that I could use. I didn't even realize that that was on there. So yay. So there's a coupon code. And then there's a, another little card. You don't have to be perfect to be amazing. Well, I'm not perfect. That is for damn show. <laughs> anyway. I'm not perfect at all, y'all. And I always try to tell people that I am not perfect at all. Then we have another little card there. And then we have some freebies. She has some um, girls on here. I think these are her characters. I don't know what their names are, but these are cute. And then. I think this is called a switch y'all I, I don't play games video games so I don't know but these are cute then she gave me a another one oh there's that little coffee mug y'all 
that was on the card, the journaling card. And then here's a little planner. These are cute, 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 cute. All right, into the purchase, y'all. What I picked, uh-oh, are we blurry? There we go. Usually uh, when I move something out of frame, we'll get blurry, but here we go. So I picked up some Happy Mail stickers from her, y'all. I just was in love with all of her Happy Mail stickers. So here is the first set. Uh, we have the little packages that uh, some of our Happy Mail items come in. Then we have look like some gift wrap packaging and all of that. And then I picked up some post office stickers because I am always in and out of the post office for something. And y'all look at these right here. These right here I fell in love with. The bunny delivering the happy mail. I was like, I'm gonna use these. Now, it says that these were um, Valentine's Day stickers. I think that's what I read on her, um, on the website. But, you know, I'm gonna use these all year. <laughs> Cause they are just too cute. So, I don't care y'all. I thought these were too cute. And then I picked up planners and tacos. Uh, these stickers are named after Shanice from over at Planners and Tacos, y'all. And I thought these were so cute. And I can always use these when I am marking something exciting. Um, I loved how she was jumping up and down with her planners and her tacos. And I loved her little puff balls on her hair. So I picked those up. So I did not realize that I had a 30% off coupon from Birch and Birdie, but that's good to know. So I will be going back and picking up some things from her. But this is my purchase from Birch and Birdie. Next, we have a purchase from the Sweet Planner. This is my first time picking up some things from her. And you guys, here are the freebies. We have some flags, and then this one, we have a cup of coffee, some florals, and some glasses. So that's our freebie, we got two. And then y'all, I picked up some floral deco, or I guess uh, you call these her deco sheets. And, let me see if I have my invoice so I can go over the names of these with y'all. So, um, what is this one called? So I have two. So this one right here must be called Spring Bloom. And look how cute that is y'all with the girl in her, in her bag y'all. I love this when I saw this on her website. And then this one is called um, Spring Cafe. I love the little bag. I love the girl holding her coffee and of course all of the florals and coffee and all of that good stuff. And then we have Me Time. You know your girl loves a little Me Time. <laughs> But I thought this one was really cute. And y'all, these came right on time. And then this one is Sunflower. Oh my gosh, y'all, look at her little outfit, the hat, the bag, the glasses, and the book. And y'all, I actually have shoes like this that I picked up from Target a couple of years ago. I love them so much. Instead of them being blue, they are pink though. But I love those shoes so, so much. <laughs> and then I picked up some of her work script. Just some black and white work script, y'all. But anyhow, uh, like I was saying earlier, these right here came right on time, y'all, because I 
was working on my March monthly. Let me get it for y'all. And so I picked up my March monthly from, um, let me see this shot. Uh, Lexi Collie Designs this time. And um, her monthly starts up here whereas the monthly that I picked up for January and February um you get this big old side piece over here and then I have nothing to put up here which I still don't have nothing to put up there because I don't think any of these match but now that I have this deco let's see if I have something that will match Maybe not that one. But anywho, uh, I'm going to play around with this, y'all, and see if I can get some of this deco to fit on the side bar over here. And then if not, I'll try to go back and see if I can find something to fit on this side bar. But anywho, <laughs> that's everything I picked up from Sweet Platter. I am super excited to see if I can incorporate these things into my planning or into these monthlies or you know something but these are just really really pretty y'all really really pretty next we have a purchase from paper muse crafts now this is not my first purchase from her I just haven't purchased from her in a very long time but here is our freebie you guys so cute I can use all of these things on here oh my gosh y'all there is even a hammer and a screwdriver I did not see this y'all on her $2 Tuesday or else I would have picked these up oh my gosh I would have picked these up y'all if I had seen these <laughs> Anyhow, these are a part of her $2 Tuesdays I picked up some cars in all three foils. There's the gold, and then this is her rose gold. Oh, that rose gold. That's not a pinky rose gold. It doesn't look like it. It almost looks gold if you if you turn it a different kind of way. But there's that, and then here is oh. You see what I mean? In the camera, this looks gold, but this is actually silver. So let's see what all of this looks like in the camera. Oh, okay. You can kind of tell the difference there when they are all together like that. But I picked those up, and then y'all look how cute these little Target stickers are. Oh my gosh, so cute. I also picked these up in all three foils. So cute. And then I picked up some more mail uh, stickers. Now I am not sure if these are supposed to be post office or delivering some happy mail, but I guess you could use it for either or, right? <laughs> but I picked them up because I thought they were cute, y'all. <laughs> that is my purchase right now from a paper muse crafts y'all alrighty next I have a purchase from honey inked this is my first time I'm making a purchase from her and I love this in the package so you guys could see the cute little uh, sticker there I love this little clear and frosted envelope so let's just dive right in. All right, so the first thing I have here is the freebie that came with the purchase. And it looks like we have a Happy Mail box or, hmm, what is that y'all? I don't know. We have prescription, yoga, a clock, a book, Hmm, a clapper and something to drink. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm a hot mess. Then we have a to-do script, day off script, important script, and meeting script. 
those are cute and they are all in black and on uh, clear paper so what I picked up this go around are these floral flowers deco uh, I am trying to up my game but not really up my game but just you know I'm trying to add more uh, different um, items into my spreads and monthlies so I picked up two of these in the rose gold because she didn't have any gold at the time when I purchased these so I just got two uh, silver and two rose gold so that's everything I picked up from Honey Inks uh, in this uh, particular uh, part of the haul y'all I should have something coming pretty soon for the second half of the haul or you know adding to the haul because if you guys are not familiar I uh, when I get my artists in I just go ahead and film them so I can put them up and start using them uh, I don't want to have everything you know just piling up because after you film a haul it's just you have so much and then you have to put everything up so I just do my hauls in little increments so anywho let's move on to the next <laughs> We have something from Sadie Stickers. You guys know it's not gonna be a haul unless I have something from Sadie Stickers. Uh, I have just been loving her lately. So this is the deco sheet that came with this purchase. And here is the sticker kit that came with this purchase, you guys. Now, if you are not familiar with Sadie Stickers, which I know if you guys are planner peeps, then you guys know all about Sadie stickers but she recently um, released some brand new planners and if you picked up your planner during uh, the very first release then you got to pick a free sticker kit and this is the sticker kit that I picked Talk about the free kit that I got with my purchase for buying the planner I did pick up her deco sheet. She is now offering uh, deco sheets that you can pick up with some of her kits. And um, it has different uh, type of boxes on here. Uh, hexagon box. Is that a hexagon? I know this is a hexagon, so that can't be a hexagon. Anywho. Um, <laughs> You also have this shaped box and this shaped box as well. We have the date covers. This is an add-on sheet with the B6 kit. So there are the date covers, like I said. We have a flag here. We have some teardrops here. We have some small scalloped boxes here. And then we have some pattern headers on this sheet as well. And then here is the kit that I picked up this was her may kit she does have may monthlies to match this kit now she recently formatted her kits so um i have a kit here that we're gonna look at but this is the full boxes y'all these are so pretty i love the colors in this kit that's why i picked this up because i thought this was different and appropriate for May and then this is the box page and then you have some bottom washi here you have more headers here uh, some deco pieces here then you have two scallop boxes some square boxes third boxes and uh, you have different shaped boxes here as well with the different uh, corners on the page so let's take a look at one of her old kits to see the difference in the format I don't even know if she reformatted oh yeah it looked like she did she definitely reformatted this sheet here because these right here are flags where you don't get those flags on this sheet and then you get these scalloped uh, boxes instead of the 
hexagon. No, these are circles, so you still get a couple of circles. You just don't get the little flags on that page. And then um, instead of the bow headers, you got decorative headers here. So that's the difference on the um, add-on date covers for the B6. And then let's take a look at our box page. So this is the old format, the new format. Uh, that's pretty much the same. Uh, instead of bows on the tracker, you just get a Monday through Sunday tracker, but um, this page is pretty much the same. And then let's look at the box page and see what the difference is here. Let's turn it this way since. So it looks like she added scallop boxes on this page and you still get uh, headers here. Oh, and she added the deco pieces instead of the flags. And let's see. It's pretty much the same instead of uh, all of the little um, quarter boxes here, you get two scallop boxes. You get, it looks like you get more smaller boxes here because here you have one, two, three half boxes. Oh, this is a half box as well. So yeah, it's, it's different. Uh, you know, if I didn't have these two sheets sitting in front of me, I wouldn't have known the difference <laughs> on the pages. Uh, but yeah, that's the difference between the reformat, you guys. Then here is the planner, y'all. This is another B6 size planner. Now I said I was gonna try to get a um, A5, just a regular size A5, but when I saw her do this planner on her uh, Instagram channel, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna give that a try. So this is the cover that I picked, just a um, mauve pink color with the black writing. And then when you open it up, you get this clear uh, piece of paper right here, frosted paper. And then it has this planner belongs to. It is an undated planner, you guys. It has tabs on the side where you can go in and her shop or anybody's shop and you can pick up the dates uh, here if you want to. Not dates, the monthlies, which I'm gonna pick up some monthlies from her. I think she is going to be participating in that same sale that cr Cricket, not Cricket, oh my gosh, that Sticker Guru is going to be particip participating in. So I'm probably going to go pick up uh, a monthly from her and the date covers and all that stuff. But when you open up the planner, you have this right here, a monthly overview that you can decorate, put birthdays in and all of that good stuff. And then you have the monthly right here. Uh, this is a little bit, let me show y'all this monthly in here. Now this is a lights planner action uh, planner. And let me show you guys the month, one of the monthly. So here's May. So you guys can tell, so you guys can tell the difference in the color of the paper already. Now this is lights planner action, like I said, and this is doodly, this is a doodle font. But you have nothing here, so you have a sidebar over here, no sidebar, but you can use this as a sidebar if you wanted to, because you can do Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and then you can cover that up if you like. And then at the top, I'm assuming you could put dates up there if you want, or you can put them down here. I'm not familiar with her monthly, uh, stickers, but I'm going to buy one to see how that is going to work. 
and then you can see up here in the lights kind of action that she has this here and this and then the dates and things like that but uh, as far as the paper I picked this up because another reason I picked this up is because uh, as you guys can see here you really don't have to use liquid paper to block anything out whereas in this planner from lights planner action i'm using liquid paper to cover up the dates i'll use liquid paper down here but that's not uh this planner's fault you do have options when it comes to lights planner action this is just the planner that i chose uh, because I didn't realize that she had all of the different planners. So that's, that's my fault that I am liquid papering all of this stuff out. Uh, but the main reason I wanted to pick this planner up, y'all, is because she said that you can put stickers on this planner. And you can pull them up and the paper is not going to tear. So I want to put that to action and see if that's really going to work. Because trust and believe me, if you put a sticker on this paper and try to pick it up, it is going to tear. Now this paper feels like regular um, copy paper. Not the thin copy paper, but it does have a little bit of a weight to it, but it's not as thick as this paper this paper feels like cardstock i don't know if you guys can hear the difference but you can feel the weight in this paper right here uh, compared to this paper right here so that is one of the main reasons why i wanted to pick this planner up so let's see if i can peel this sticker up I might cannot y'all because of my nails but let me see oh I put it down too I put it down too good oh look look I'm probably gonna tear up this sticker trying to get this up because of these nails that I have on okay let me see if I can all right y'all let's take these tweezers and see if this sticker will come up without tearing the paper oh my gosh I'm tearing up my sticker gosh okay so her paper is not tearing y'all but my sticker is tearing Ugh. oh well it is what it is right all right so that did come off without tearing her paper but my sticker tore up so yeah there's that little tear <laughs> anywho uh, I am not one to jump planners in the middle of a planner because I done paid my little money for this planner. So I definitely want to keep using it. So uh, at least I'll have this one for next year, y'all. And also another thing is why I wanted to pick this planner up because she does have these little side tabs on here. And they have this little, you know, plastic thing on them already whereas with this planner y'all I uh, ordered these off of Etsy and it's nothing wrong with them but I don't know if you guys can see how that how they're bending already and look this one I need to put that one back on there it's not even on there you know really good I need to get some glue or something to make that stick on there but you see how they are already bending and stuff like that and that is getting on my nerves already and i'm like Ugh. but you know it is what it is <laughs> i'm the 
type of person. I just go with the flow. I, like I said, I don't want to change planners because I hate to do that and I hate to waste money. So I'm just going to probably just put this up until next year and we will be using this for our 2022. That sounds so weird, y'all. But that is what we are going to be using this planner here for and I just went ahead and picked it up so that I could get a free sticker kit because that never happens, y'all. <laughs> we have some more items from Sadie's stickers. These were $2 Tuesdays, of course. So let's just go through these items real quick. These were separate $2 Tuesdays. And let's just go through this one first. So it looks like I picked up some mandalas and look like I just picked those up in a gold foil. Her $2 Tuesdays y'all have been so good. And then here I picked up some of the uh, garland I have been seeing these in a lot of planner people's spreads, so I definitely wanted to give these a try to see if I could work with those. And I think I'll hold uh, some of those before. <laughs> and then I picked up some rose gold date dots in this particular $2 Tuesday. And then we have the Dango Deco Sheet 1. Now these are on white paper, you guys. I decided to try these on white paper. And they are just kiss cut, a little uh, dangle decorations there. And I also got the, um, the um, um, garland in white, uh, on white paper too. So I usually get those kind of things on clear paper, but I decided to try them on white paper to see how that's going to work. And then next we have some of the little bowls that you can just add on to some of your um, non-foiled boxes if you like, just to spruce them up. But yeah, I picked up the rose gold, the silver, and the gold, as you guys can see there. And then it looks like I picked up some Bee Trail Deco. Uh, yeah, I think I have one kit that might be bee themed. <laughs> so I just went ahead and picked these up and they are on white paper as well. Th those are so cute, y'all. So, so cute. And her, her paper is so smooth and buttery for a $2 Tuesday. But yeah, pick those up and then let's get into the second one. Now this second one I think is... Uh, the $2 Tuesday that she brought back items that uh, people were liking. So uh, here are the butterflies that I was telling you guys about in the first half of the haul. And these are in Halo. Y'all, that Halo is so pretty to me. Then I picked it up in the rose gold as well. And I picked it up in silver foil. Now I don't know why I picked these up in silver foil. I have no kit with butterflies in silver. And I use silver a lot in the winter, as we all do, but <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna be using butterflies in the winter. But you know what, it's okay, we shall see. And then I picked them up in light gold as well. But these are just gorgeous, 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 I love them. And then it looked like I picked up some mini deco as well because I am running out of these. The last time I picked some of these up, y'all, I got them from uh, Tassel to Planners and I am running out quick. So I needed to get some more of these. So yeah, that is everything you guys from Sadie's Stickers. Now this weekend was the Planner Boss uh collective sale and i did pick up a few more items from her <laughs> so as soon as i get those items we will be hauling those as well next i have a purchase from one of my favorite shops for character girls and that is valia and tuma or valia and tuma i never know if i'm saying that right y'all but yeah, no, it's it's okay 
so let's get this open i love her stickers y'all i think that they are just so so cute one of my favorite characters so first we have nia eating tacos y'all i thought these were so cute and i needed some more cute taco stickers and then we have who wants pancakes nia is up and fixing pancakes y'all <laughs> And then this is a new character that she just introduced to her shop and her name is Jada. And Jada is having a nice relaxed evening. And then I picked up Nia again. She is uh, making a gingerbread house. Now I picked these up y'all cause I'm always decorating my house. If you follow me over at Lisa Lynette, then you know that I have a vlog channel over there and uh, I do a lot of decorating. And when I saw her uh, building this little gingerbread house, I was like, that will be perfect for marking and decorating. And then I have, um, I don't forgot what this little character girl's name. But uh, she's just sitting on the couch eating some chips. It just says movie time. So I picked this one up, thought these were cute. Then I have um, that same girl cleaning the bathtub. So we are assuming that I will be using these for when I'm cleaning up my bathroom, y'all. <laughs> And then here is the cute little journaling card that came with the purchase. So, so cute, y'all. But yeah, that's everything that I picked up from Valea and Tuma. Okay, next, I have a purchase from Honey Inked. This was her spring collection that she just released. And I picked up some things from that. Let me get all of this out of here, y'all. Well, first thing I have here is the freebie. I just showed you guys this one. It is the same thing. And then, what is this right here? This is a spring free freebie in rose gold. So cute. This is a really big freebie, y'all. So, so cute. So I picked up some more of these small garlands, y'all. I figure like because I have a B6 planner, these would work really good in uh, the B6, especially for my monthly. So I wanted to pick up some smaller garland. So I did pick that up in a rose gold and I picked it up in the gold and the silver. And is this light gold? Or is this just regular gold? Let me see. I might have just picked up two gold ones. Yeah. Oh, no, no. This is light gold and this is regular gold from the looks of it, y'all. But anyhow, picked up some small garland. Then I also picked up some of these little tiny stardust. These are in silver. And we have silver, rose gold. I wanted to pick these up so I could show y'all all together so I wouldn't have to be, so I wouldn't be redundant, y'all. <laughs> but anywho, there are all three of the foil colors. And then I picked up some stacked mandalas. Look like she called them stacked mandala trim. And let's see, let's make sure I get all of these up. Uh, did I pick all of these up, people? Girl. I don't even know, but I have them. So we have, look like it's two gold, one light gold, and one rose gold. These are really pretty, y'all. So yeah, these are really, really cute, y'all. I cannot wait to start using these, start layering, and just seeing what I can come up with in my spreads. And then the last thing I picked up from Honey Ink were some of these, uh, what are we gonna call these y'all? Are we gonna call these the stems? Because they are not flowers and they are not plants. So we're just gonna call them some stems. I picked up some gold stems to see how I would like these and how I would use them in my uh, spreads. 
So yeah, that's everything I picked up from Honey Inked. I thought I had picked up more from Honey Inked, but I guess I did not. So that is my purchase, y'all. Next, we have a purchase from Letters to Apollo, and here is the cute little journaling card that came with the purchase. That's so cute. And then let's see what I picked up. Y'all, her little packaging is just so, so cute. On the envelope it says, did you just do a happy dance? I think you did. <laughs> of course we do happy dances when we get our happy mail. It's always exciting. So the first thing I have here are some mandalas, y'all. Look like it's mandala lace number six. And I picked those up in all three foils. Thought these were really cute. Next I picked up lace headers and I picked these up in three foils but this is not a uh, silver foil this is halo foil and then I got rose gold and gold light gold I usually pick up light gold from her shop and then I picked up some of the lace doily circles is what I am going to call them <laughs> and I picked those up in the light gold halo and the rose gold as well that is everything that I picked up from letters to Apollo and y'all I just placed a really big two dollar Tuesday order from her shop because she brought back some stuff that she had originally had in her two dollar Tuesdays and I guess it was customers request to bring back and y'all ooh, I picked up so much ooh. <laughs> moving on I have a new shop to me this is called buttercream stickers and y'all I found this shop on Etsy because I was googling up some stickers and <laughs> her shop popped up but here is the cute little card that came with the purchase. It is a thank you card with all of her information on there. And then let's dive into this order. Everybody has such cute packaging, y'all. You hate to tear and rip all of the stuff up. But ah! <laughs> all right, everything is nicely packed in an envelope. There we go. So, um, I think she was participating in a sale and I just so happened, like I said, came across her shop. Let me zoom y'all in a little bit. Let me zoom out, let me zoom y'all in. All right, like I said, I came across her shop just by Googling, um, what was I Googling y'all? I don't remember, but anyhow, um, I placed this order on Sunday y'all this order got to me on Thursday so she must be a ready to ship uh, shop because I was so surprised when I got this in the mail on Thursday but anywho <laughs> uh, here is a freebie and this must have came with the sale let me see it says pink planner sale freebie so yeah it was a sale going on and I just so happened like I said I came across it so yeah it was really nice that I got a good discount on the stickers all right so there's the freebie this freebie is from Kenzie's creations but that's nice and then we have something from Idaho paper co some cute little foiled floral um, flags. Then I have something from Heather B. Co. Everything is nice and foiled, so cute. These are, oh my gosh, these are script uh, foil stickers. I definitely can use these, that is for sure. And then here is a little thank you. Oh, we must be diving into her stickers now. So there is the little thank you note, y'all. It's just uh, some full boxes, some um, matte full boxes there. And then this must be, this is a sampler, it says buttercream stickers, and it is in halo foil, as you guys can see. And 
this is so cute y'all okay it look like we have some stickers here we have candle we have nail polish what is this look like a little credit card maybe i'm not really sure then we have happy mail a laptop some more stickers and then what's that we have some floor right here a camera so yeah that's cute i definitely can use all of these so that's uh the same thing oh is it the same thing no it's not the same thing it's a different sampler but she sent two of those uh there there's a cake right there and a cologne bottle or a perfume bottle right there but they are all as you guys can see in halo foils oh this is what i was googling i was googling uh garland uh stickers and that is what i picked up she had these in her shop and i think they were like a dollar and something or let me see yeah they were a dollar and something so i was like okay and then i got a discount on top of that y'all so i picked up the gold of course the silver and then the rose of gold yeah i wanted to uh, get some more of these y'all because i realized that during the two dollar tuesday that i that i didn't pick up much and i was like you know what i'm gonna be using those a lot so let me see if i can find some more of those and then y'all she had these cute little uh dangled <laughs> uh heart and silver garland and i was like those are cute and they are small she did have them in a large size but you guys know that i am planning in a b6 so i was like let me try some of those just to see what i can do with those so i picked those up in the, the, all three foiled colors for the usual and then I picked the and then I picked up the mini uh garland dot banners as well. Can you guys see that? All three foils. How cute are those? And her paper is matte. It is a matte paper, and you do have the option to get uh clear or white, whatever your heart desires in her shop as well. And what is this? Oh, here is another sampler y'all my goodness she filled me up on samplers didn't she but look y'all you got more little uh dangle stickers there how cute is that the floral uh sticker there so cute y'all my goodness and then i picked up some more mandalas and all three foiled colors and these are her mandalas number 17 all right y'all i'm gonna have so many of these mandalas because i think i've been picking them up a lot but i want to build this up so i don't have to you know buy too many stickers because i have already said y'all that i have put myself on a no spin after this pbc sale last this past weekend i'm like girl you need to slow it down <laughs> so next i have something from the giving girl now i have shopped from the giving girl lots and lots and lots of times before but i haven't picked up anything from her in a while because last year y'all i was not picking up very many stickers all i was picking up was pb weeks kits and that was it i kind of took myself out of planner world i would you know post my pictures on instagram and that would be it i was not even interested in buying any stickers or anything like that but now <laughs> since i am doing my b6 i have gotten very much into my planner again and i am loving all of the things now let me tell y'all what happened with the given girl i have been seeing all of the planner people with these cute little boxes and i was like oh my gosh i need some of those they are gorgeous and i love how they just pop them into the spreads here and there and it just does something to a spread so i was like i need to get some of those stickers from the giving girl well y'all know she had her 
was it three year anniversary or something like that? And I was like, let me um, go on there and let me get some stickers. So I went in there y'all and I put some stickers in my cart and I left. <laughs> that was doing the sale. So uh, the next thing I know y'all, she had done closed the shop. I said, oh my God, I should have checked out, but I just put the, my stuff in the cart and I love. So she closed y'all for about a month, I would say. At least three to three to four. Yeah, I think it was about a month she closed. And when she opened back up, she was doing grab bags. And I was like, I need to get her box grab bag. So I was all excited and I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna get me a grab bag. So her shop, I think is in Canada or somewhere. I don't know exactly where it is, but it's not in the United States. So she opened her shop bag and I forgot what the time was, but it was uh, Eastern Standard Time, something like that. And so I calculated, you know, what time the shop was gonna open. And I think that it opens up nine o'clock Central Standard Time, but I could be wrong because I think I am wrong. I think it opens up at eight o'clock. But y'all, she opened up the shop. I clicked on it exactly nine o'clock, y'all, and all of the grab bags were gone. Oh my God! Yeah, I was so so upset. I really wanted to get her box grab bags, so I couldn't get any of the box grab bags. So I just picked up a few stickers from her, a few of the grab bags. So let's just take a look. So when you open her packaging, you get a washi card right here this says find something you love and do it forever and then here is the little sampler that i got it has a pink and white gingham um box and then you have some more little floral boxes here some uh bow stickers here and some uh washi right here so that's cute and Y'all, don't be surprised. This is not a lot. Like I said, I was trying to get me a grab bag, so I just picked up a few. <laughs> but I tell you, I wanted a grab bag so bad. Alrighty, so here is what I picked up. This is the box, uh, well, the bow box sampler in Ice Flow, and I got it with gold bowls. Now, I don't know why I picked this up, y'all. Just was trying to get some, I suppose. But this has little snowflakes in it, so I won't even be using the ones with the snowflakes right away. Uh, but I love this color, and uh, y'all know blue is my favorite color, so I had to pick some of these up. Now, I should have been picking these up with the silver bowls, but uh, I think she may have been sold out. So that's why I just ended up getting the gold ones. And then these are lemon in gold foil. How cute are these? Y'all, I'm telling y'all, I am in love and I want more of these stickers, but I'm not going to pick up any right now. I'm gonna see if she's gonna bring out anything new. But this is pink frosting in gold. Uh, looks like I picked up two pink frostings in gold. <laughs> yeah, uh, I use a lot of pink spreads, so. Oh no! Nope. Y'all see? One of these is rose gold, and this one right here is rose gold, and I thought it was gold, but this one right here is gold. But yeah, I am so in love. I love these little boxes. Her paper is so soft and oh my gosh, y'all, I need more. <laughs> All right, y'all, we are into a new week. I have about six more shops that I want to share with y'all. And the first one is Lexi Collie Designs. I picked up a few of her monthly kits. 
Uh, I have been loving her monthly layouts for my B6. So here is the little card that came with the purchase. It says rise, rise. And on the back, you have all of her information and a little coupon code. And then we are just going to jump into these kits. Now this is the May deco sheet. And look at this y'all. Can you see the vibe that is going on with this deco sheet? And then here are the boxes y'all. I am loving this already. And then here is the May Monthly. I fell instantly in love with all of this, y'all. This is giving me boho vibes. I love the colors in this. I'm going to be totally honest with y'all. I am just feeling all of the neutrals. Uh, and I kind of wish my whole planner could look like this. <laughs> like all neutral all year long. But this year that's just not going to happen but i am so excited to be using this for may and then we have the june monthly the june is also a neutral let's get that out of the way so that won't be distracting it is also a neutral kit as well but it does bring out the summer Look at this deco sheet, y'all. You got your bathing suit cover up with the hat. You got palm leaves. You have more leaves here. You have a bathing suit. Just giving me all the summer feels right here, y'all. So then we have the little boxes that come with her monthlies. And then we have the monthly. But yeah, guys, I, like I said, I am loving these neutral kits. I'm telling you, I wish that my whole uh, planner for could be in this neutral aesthetic here. <laughs> Anywho, that's everything that I picked up from Lexi Kali Design. I have something from Christina's Paper Studio. This is a small little order, y'all. Uh, but I wanted you guys to see her packaging. She does have a little frosted envelope and a little stamp on the back. So let's just jump into this purchase. So the first thing we have here is her business card. This says you are enough and then it has little florals on here. And the back is her business logo. Now what I picked up, oh, we're not going to get into what I picked up. We're going to get into this freebie. <laughs> this is a freebie from Laurel Lee Plans. And we look like we have some dividers. And then we have some gold uh, floral deco pieces. And then I have another freebie here. Uh, this is an all order freebie. And it is also filled with uh deco pieces and look like some floral dividers these are really really cute now i don't recall putting in anybody's name for a freebie but i did get these beautiful freebies right here and like i said this is a small order all i picked up were some deco sheets some floral deco sheets and this is uh, florals number two in gold and then this room right here is just florals. So, so cute. I love this one right here, y'all. Love that one. And then I picked up another sheet of the florals and gold as well. But like I said, you guys, I am really trying to build up my um, collection of florals and boxes and all of that stuff. So... That is what we are doing. But anywho, this is my purchase from Christina's Paper Studio. All right. Next, I have a kit from Vanilla Paper and Co. And y'all, look at this cute little freebie. So cute. I think that is a circle uh, mandala. A 
a two piece. I guess you could put this together or you could use it separately. But that's so cute. And then here is the little free sheet that comes with your uh, kit purchase. And you, know, you guys know that it matches the kit. And there's that little foil look. These are just icons and headers. And here is the kit, you guys. When she showed this on her channel, y'all, I was in love. I was like, I got to get that. <laughs> now, I knew I had Easter kits already, but I was like, I am getting that, even if I have to save it next year. And that is exactly what is going to happen since we have past Easter, y'all. <laughs> But there was a lot of talk about this shop when I watch other people's videos. But I don't have a problem with this shop. I love her pricing. The only thing, like I said, about this shop is the weight. And if you put your uh, purchase, I mean, if you put your order in for her stickers uh, when she dropped them, then you will more than likely get them. Um, when you need them now this one i did not order on time i think i ordered it like a week or two late but she dropped this kit a little late so i knew that this wasn't going to come in time for easter but like i said i really wanted it anywho so y'all look at this box scene right here and look how saturated the colors are in this scene it is just so beautiful to me. Look at that gold foil on there. I never have an issue with her foiling. I never have an issue with her boxes or anything. Uh, this paper is very, very uh, smooth and buttery, but I, uh, I don't have a problem with her shop. <laughs> But there are the nine full boxes. And this is a mini kit. I do pick up her mini kits because um, I don't need the larger kits. So here is the second sheet. You have some script on here, your weekend and banner. You have some quarter boxes, habit trackers. You have your checklist up there, flags, some more circle um, boxes, some more flags here. And then you have your box page where you get some scalloped boxes, uh, half boxes. You get some labels here and some buildos up here. And then on this sheet, you get your bottom washi. Y'all look how pretty that bottom washi is with the little uh, coffee um, mugs here. And then you have the scene here. I love how she did this blue and it's kind of like a peachy pink and my color, my favorite color is blue and then my second favorite color is pink so I love pink and blue especially when it's mixed together and then you have your um, extra box right here which the extra box is not foiled but that's okay you can always put some foil on here and then you have your date covers on this sheet as well now she recently started doing b6 kits so my next purchase from her will be some b6 kits i wanted to see how they would compare to just you know buying a smaller kit so i will be sharing those when they come in as well but that is my purchase from vanilla paper and coat next up we have Alyssa's craft shop and this is my first time making a purchase from Alyssa's craft shop now this shop is located in hawaii and y'all i just picked up some of our two dollar tuesday circles and i picked those up last week and this kit got to me really quick <laughs> for it to be coming from hawaii <laughs> but here is the little card that came with the purchase and then here is our freebie right here you have some script and some icons down at the bottom and this is on look like some translucent paper or something it's not a foiled freebie but 
it's very interesting so I'm gonna have to play with this and see and then like I said I only picked up some of her two dollar Tuesday she had these doilies for two dollars y'all I was like OMG let me stack up on some of those and I just picked them up in all of the colorways that she had so you have a gold the silver I picked up the rose quartz and we have the rose of gold which her rose gold is a pinky rose gold and then I also picked up blue baby blue it just says baby blue I thought it was something oh yeah there's another sheet and then I picked up dusty pink as well but uh, yeah that's everything that I picked up from Alyssa's craft shop these little doilies are so cute y'all and let me compare them to um letters to apollo little circles hold on one second okay so i used one of these little circles in one of my spreads this week and i just wanted to compare them and uh, let me get a, a gold one so we can compare um how the size the Letters to Apollo's Lil Doily is a little bit bigger than the Alyssa's Craft Shop. But yeah, y'all, I thought this was such a good deal. You get so many of these doilies and they were only $2. So I was like, uh, yes, I need to get those. <laughs> but I, I uh, really like this shop. She did have some really cute kits but her kits were larger kits and I don't like to buy large kits unless I just absolutely love them so this is everything that I picked up from Alyssa's craft shop you guys we have a purchase from Birch and Birdie and y'all her packaging is just so cute and then I love all the washi that she uh puts on these packagings y'all I just love it love it love it but this little envelope like I said it's just adorable I just love it all but I picked up this beautiful kit right here. I saw Shanice over at Flounder and Tacos. She used this in her B6 planner and I was like, I need to get that kit. That, that kit is too cute. But the first thing I have to show you guys is this really cute card this is so cute i am definitely going to put this in my planner and then the back just has some cupcakes how cute is that y'all so so cute i love that and then we have more of the little freebies that was in our earlier order and then y'all look at this beautiful 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 kit I loved, what I really loved about it was <laughs> this pink and red and blue. Something just drew me to this color, this box right here. So I was like, oh my gosh, I need to get that. And then I loved how she put all of the purple and all of the colors. Look at this yellow box down here I just loved how it just all flowed together so I needed to get this kit when I saw Shanice use this kit so again this is another shop that shipped really fast I ordered this one week and it came in the following week so really fast shipping on her part and then here is the bottom washi strawberries y'all oh my gosh I'm definitely going to be using this this coming summer and then here is the um, date covers your weekend banner you got some more girls you got some work script and you have a floor I mean it's not floor it's the strawberries but this is a little doily as well how cute is that you got some flags up here in the top and then you have a habit tracker some more trackers and you have these smaller little hexagon circles and things like that down here and these are some kiss cut girls that you can use 
as well. But yeah, I love this kit. Like I said, I did use a code from Shanice as well. You can put um, Shanice. Y'all can go on Planner and Toggle's uh, Instagram page or her uh, YouTube channel to get her codes. Uh, but I know it's Shanice. I don't know the number that's at the back of her code. But I did use her code. So I helped her out a little bit. But yeah, that is this purchase from Birch and Birdie. All right, y'all. Now, the last shop that I am going to be sharing with y'all is a shop that I have been waiting for. Y'all, I placed the order for these stickers in February, and they just got to me on yesterday. What was yesterday's day? April 24th? They just got to me on April 24th. Now, I am not a person to complain. I don't normally complain about anything, but that was just taking too long. So I did have to message her and ask what was going on with these stickers because that was just, like I say, just absolutely too, too long. Anywho, <laughs> I did... Uh, make two orders i did one like one day and then i did another one a couple of days later but anyhow let's just get into what i picked up y'all there's a label on the back with my name it's real pretty oh i didn't want to tear it but let's see there we go All right so i just went ahead and opened up both of the um purchases but uh, you did get this really pretty pink uh, card that says hello gorgeous on the one side and there's nothing on the oh no uh, the pretty pink coat is on the back I don't know if I said the name of the shop but it is a pretty pink coat and then like I said I did complain about this uh, order so she sent this little letter in here hi there we're so sorry for the long processing time for your order we had a hiccup with production thank you so much for your love and support we would like to offer you a five dollar off coupon code that you can use on your next purchase thank you for your patience we hope you love everything thank you the pretty pink cold team so i did get a five dollar off coupon she only put it in the one order because i didn't complain about this one but i did complain about this one but I should have complained about this one as well because, like I said, I just I put in the order a couple of days later. So, anywho, here is the freebie that came with the purchase. This is a gold foil header freebie. And then I guess this is the regular uh, freebie that you get or a shop freebie. That's really pretty. We do have two of those while we are here. And then I picked up a bunch of her little $2 Tuesdays, y'all. So, uh, like I said, I have been trying to build my little collection of mandalas and boxes and florals and all of that stuff up. Uh, I think I have enough now, y'all. I think I'm good for a while. But anyway, I picked up this mandala sheet right here, half mandala number two in uh, all three colors you have your gold silver and rose gold uh -oh, so, oh let me turn this around because i guess this is upside down i picked up some floral mini floral deco sheets you have your rose gold your silver and your gold then i picked up some more school wiggle wiggles y'all i was in desperate need for some squibbles. My squibbles have dwindled all the way down. So we have the three colors there. There we go. And this one I was most excited for. I think this one is adorable. So, so cute. I can't wait to use these. This is Squiggle 3.0. And then I picked up peonies and mini squiggles. 
and all of three of the foils. And then I picked up Manda Half Mandala 4.0. I really like these, y'all. These were so cute. So, so cute. And then this is uh, what I was telling you guys that I had picked up some bunnies and the kit, you know, the stickers were not here, but these are uh, Easter Bunny Squiggles. That's silver. Then I picked up the date dots and the bunny date dots. These are silver as well. I picked up uh, some uh, sleeping in stickers. But it, but it says bow icon, it says nap time, but I'm gonna be using them for sleeping in. And then I picked up some floral circles 2.0 and all three foils. Then I picked up some Happy Mail in all three foils. There we go. Now y'all, I could have sworn that I had picked up those bow, I mean not bow, the bunny uh, things in rose gold, but look like I got them in silver. I should check my invoice, but at this point right now, it is what it is. I have already done that spread and it's done and <laughs> we're good. Next year, I guess I'm gonna have to get a Easter kit with some silver in it. And then, like I said, I went back and I picked up some more of the heart dividers. Uh, this is heart divider 2.0 in all three colors. And then we have half mandala 4.0 in three colors. And then I picked up floral circles 2.0 again in the colors as well. All right, so yeah, like I said, that's everything that I picked up from the Pretty Pink Ho. Now, I did give this shop one more try, y'all. This is one of the shops that I did um, order from during the PBC sale. I only, I only ordered from three shops. This was one of them, and I ordered something from Sadie Stickers, and then I ordered from a new shop to me, and that order is already on its way. So... Anyhow, we're going to see how they do with this uh, purchase from the PBC sale. And yeah, we shall see. <laughs> All right, y'all. That is going to be it for this month's sticker haul. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all of the stickers that I picked up for the past few months. And if you are new to my channel, would you please consider subscribing, um, helping a girl out, helping a girl grow her channel. I am a planner babe, just like all of the popular planner people here on YouTube and Insta. And I would greatly appreciate your support. Now, as always guys, I hope you are having a great day and or a great week whenever you are viewing this video right here and i will talk to you guys in the next one bye y'all <laughs>